Hello there kitties, I'm Gary, the vacuum tube witch. And I got a little artifact of a bygone era. Right here in my hands, I will be trading it for some uh, Nexi displays, but uh, what is it anyway? How does it work? Uh, how did I get it? I got it from my friend uh, John Cornelis. Um, the one that uh, I was building the RPI to caster project with. Uh, this is basically the manual perforator for the computer paper type. The 8 channel um, IBM type. Uh, and this device, um, it was made in uh, Switzerland and uh, it was used for doing the manual corrections uh, in the type uh, like uh, you've got uh, a pen you hold in one hand and you hold um, the frame uh, in uh, the other and uh, drive the pin uh, in the select positions i will show you how using a uh, strip of paper let's get to the bench see how it works We got a radio restoration project still going on here. Let's zoom on in. And uh, if you want to use it first, you have to lift uh, the clamp. Normally, the computer type uh, would have a series of holes. Uh, a row of holes uh, somewhere slightly off to the side um, not to confuse um, the left and right side because it would uh, totally it would totally flip the bits this one is um, not perforated it doesn't have the row of the holes that um, those uh, little pins uh, go into so after i clamp it uh, those two will, will make uh, their own uh, perforations but it's only for the demonstrative uh, purpose click it a click and now we can do the manual uh, perforation click See? Nice holes. And then if you need to make uh, more signals, you just uh, move the tape uh, and uh, do the further portions uh, of the of the tape. And uh, if you need to cut down the, the tape the end, uh, you use this knife uh, at the end, it, uh, it works just like uh, a uh, knife used in uh, bookbinding workshops. Crisp, clean cutting surface. Thing of beauty, joy forever. This one was uh, probably for aligning the tape uh, or for pressing it uh, against um, the tool it's just so well made swiss made nice tag the real deal <laughs> 